and the Lord use him mightily to impact us here and those of us who are here. We want to continue to encourage you when the church has a joint program, a district program, we encourage you to come. Don't stay back. God is in the business of building the church. And if God is in the business of building the church, it is you and I that God is building. And we want to continue to encourage you that when we have a district program, don't stay back. Let's come together and we'll see the heart of God in our midst and we'll see the move of the Spirit. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! We are serving the living God. We are serving the living God. From the reading that we have, the Bible says that after the Jesus Christ died on the cross, there were a lot of speculations about his death. There were a lot of speculations about his resurrection. There were a lot of speculations about his life. And I think all this morning, perhaps some of us, we are still here, we are still having so much speculations in our life about the Lord Jesus Christ, about his sonship, about his, about his Messiah. Maybe we are also thinking in that life, like in the days of old, when he spoke to them, when he shared with them, when he interacted with them, they feel it, they could touch him, they could see what he could do, that no other prophet during that before him and even after him could do. They were still, many of them were still in a dilemma, many of them were still having so many things in their head about his sonship, about his messiahship. The Bible said that even when he came for his ghost, they have to confirm whether he died. They have to spare him. They have to spare him in his sight. And the Bible said that by his sight we are healed. By his sight we are healed. By his sight we are healed. The death of the Lord Jesus Christ has come to roll away. To roll away the only one in our lives. That is the message that the Lord wants me to share with us this morning. Rolling away the old man. Rolling away the old man. I don't know who is the old man this morning. I don't know who is the old man in this generation. I don't know who is the old man. But I want to tell you that the death of the Lord Jesus Christ has come to roll away the old man in your life. Hallelujah. The Bible says that after he died,